Hello, this is Dr. Derek Castleberry, Associate Professor and Program Director of Communication Media and Ethics at Mid America Christian University. I'm here with a video introduction for our first interviewee in COM 4603, Creating Social Media Presence and Cultural Movements. In this course, each week we are working to bring in guest speakers um, from throughout the world of uh, communication, communications, multimedia, and everything in between. And we're excited to absorb their information, their knowledge, their experiences, their, their trials, right? The things they have undergone to get where they are today and teach us about um, uh, what, what we can look forward to as we're looking at a plethora of directions for our own professional uh, end game, of course. And so this is an opportunity for our students to develop their interview um, question writing and question presenting skills uh, through which we will uh, put together into a program package for those guest speakers. And so I'm here to introduce uh, our first speaker up in this accelerated course cycle. We are going to bring in uh, Dr. Norma Jones. Norma Jones, um, who uh, has a master's in communication studies as well as a PhD in communication at master's from University of North Texas, of course, a PhD uh, out of Kent State University. And so she's going to be here to tell us about some of uh, hopefully many of her experiences, but don't let the credentials fool you. This is someone that has thrived outside of the world of uh, academia or what we call higher ed, all right? So she's kind of a uh, nose to the grindstone type of person, and it's going to be uh, awesome to connect with her and hear from some of her stories. Well, while in uh, higher ed, she, she has a couple of accolades we might highlight and perhaps a question or two you could throw her way if it interests you or maybe if you're doing some background research on her in lieu of writing your questions. Uh, she was a co-editor of several highly successful um, best-selling uh, books, anthologies by, uh, by the data analytics coming out of Amazon, a company we're quite familiar with. Uh, those those anthologies, which she co-edited uh, with a pair of other editors, is Heroines of Film and Television, as well as Heroines of Comics and Literature. So you can check that out. Maybe there's a strategic sample out there. You could ask, a, uh, inquire about what that process was like, although we may hear from some additional uh, content creators and uh, uh, writers and producers along the way. It's always helpful information. She was also a co-founder of the Popular Culture Studies Journal, all right? So here's someone that was able to succeed in a higher ed setting, but that's not where she comes from. And um, uh, I think that's what is most exciting about Miss uh, Jones, Dr. Jones, however we want to, to kind of uh, uh, address her, right? Whether we're being formal and uh, through those credentials and that sort of thing. But let's back up a little bit. Um, Norma is uh, um, self-reported self, uh, as foreign-born, growing up in the U.S., learned uh, communication and communication skills to adapt as a kid. So here's someone with a realistic sense of what uh, what that, what it takes to, to kind of migrate into um, a place socially, culturally, um, not just geographically. So I think um, she brings to the table some really important background information in terms of how communication played a central role, right? A pivotal role in teaching her something about adjusting to uh, life and lifestyles in the U.S., all right? And so perhaps we can inquire further, get some background information on where she comes from, right, to expand upon uh, the, that teaser there. She has uh, succeeded in professional life. So I want to hit a couple of career highlights. So these are further areas you can be developing your questions, right? So what we're trying to do through our protocols is tease out each of these dimensions, each of these life stages. So try not to kind of uh, 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 force all of your questions in a single direction, but let's spread them out across each of our speakers' 
uh, areas of, of professional development and, and life uh, experience. So um, some of her career highlights include uh, uh, stops, uh, professional stops in marketing and professional communication. This includes vice president of sales at Mission Telecom, as well as Pearls Only. Uh, and it doesn't stop there. She also has a, a bountiful amount of consulting work uh, with uh, Muller Film and Television Foundation, and has uh, more recently, let's, talk, let's shift gears a little bit, worked as a subject matter expert. That includes curriculum design. We're talking about technical writing now, um, and even some voiceover work uh, for personnel development in an organizational capacity. So anytime we think about, oh, what? What in the world can and uh, can I do with my communication degree? You can do many things. I think that's something we always try to stress is you can take it in so many directions. And we're going to hear a lot about that. Some of the different directions. And so maybe questions about comparison and contrast or uh, looking at, you know, X and comparing it to Y, right? And so uh, I think I think finally it's important to stress uh, this is this is essentially what I could qualify as a mission statement, if there ever was one from Norma, uh, she thrives at bringing together corporate lessons into classroom spaces and vice versa, bringing theories and uh, methods of uh, ideas about communication, theories about communication into corporate settings uh, to aid those just as those experiences and stories help aid the classroom which she does and she does occasionally step into a classroom space so this is exciting a well-balanced professional and not only that someone that has a deep understanding of the central relationship that media production plays in forging uh, the way that not just our social bonds and maybe our cultural bonds get created in, in modern society, but even even the way that uh, media and media mass media and media production uh, functions as a government tools, uh, uh, even even to the extent of um, philosophies on censorship, right on media control or power, right? A lot of these things. Don't be afraid to get a little philosophical there. I think you'll be rewarded um, to to either join us at, in our recording session live or, of course, submit your questions in advance. But view and screen that interview after the fact as we bring in Norm Jones, PhD, uh, our first uh, uh, interviewee uh, for this cycle of COM4603, Creating Social Media Presence and Cultural Movement.